Hey, it's Anne here from AnnSamoyLove.com and thanks for watching another video in my 30 Days to Your Next Launch series. So today I wanted to talk about something um, many of you love to come and ask me questions about and that's the tools I use. Um, specifically about communication and collaboration, these are tools that I I'm always on the lookout for something that's going to work just a little bit better. And I'm always, I'm always course correcting here and there with what works and what doesn't work. So I wanted to share the three things that we're doing right now that really seems to be helping um, and working well. So here's the thing. I have like, there's already like a high bar set for me because we had we just had it down on the LKR team on how to communicate with each other, like on a minute by minute basis if we needed to. Like we knew when to email, when to Yammer, when to Gchat, when to Skype, when to Hangout. So we had it all together. Um, with the new team, you're still kind of trying to figure all that out, and there's lots of time zone differences. And I have yet to have a complete have a complete team meeting, but I'm let that go because. You know, I'm on the West Coast. We've got someone in India. We've got someone in Philippines and someone in Scotland. So tell me how that's going to happen. So anyway, so I've had to like look at how we can best communicate with each other. The first thing is was finding a task management thing to help us make sure that like anytime I thought of something else that needed to get done, pop it in there, um, maybe assign it to someone very loosely, or at least just put it out there to the team. This needs to get done. Um, and the tool that I found was such by accident. I was watching someone else's launch and I saw how they used it during their launch. They actually did a, did a video within their launch videos. Um, so I'm using Trello now. I know I loved Rike and I love Rike still, but for the team that uh, how we're running right now, uh, Trello is a really great tool and I did use it for about a month and a half or two months with the technical person that does like some web stuff, does broadcast, does posting blog posts. And um, so what we did was we have a bucket, we have a doing, we have a review, and we have a done. Um, and those are the basic four bins that we have in our Trello board. So if you were to take a look at Trello, and maybe I'm just going to have to pull some screenshots because it's just too fun and too awesome. Imagine just uh, being able to put uh, sticky notes up on the wall and then rearrange them when they're in progress, when they're done, when they need to be reviewed. And that's been working really well. So as soon as a couple more people joined for the launch, I've just gotten them in on that and uh, it notifies you when someone updates it. Um, there's, there's all these different kinds of settings in it that make it really easy to communicate with each other. There's tagging, which everybody's really used to because of Facebook. Um, so the next thing, obviously we use Google Mail or we use just email, um, but another little thing which I haven't used before this really for this reason, um, but a woman in the Launch Lab Mastermind that I was running um, this past summer, this summer, um, oops, that's not evergreen, um, that I ran, she had her team ins create like a private Google, um, not a Google group, a Facebook group. And I just said, oh, that's great because then I can just pop random things in there. If there's a schedule change, an email change, if something's ready to go, every single person on the team is on Facebook. Everybody is usually on Facebook at least once or twice a day, probably more. And so I use Facebook, a private Facebook group with those three others. And it's not like, uh, it's more just saying, hey, you know, those are that, the Facebook group has kind of taken the place of my Yammer, my Yammer obsession, uh, thanks to Laura and the LKR team. Um, so, so I use those. We also, you know, for collaboration, it's Google Docs and it's Dropbox. I also like to work in Evernote, so I kind of am this annoying person who needs different spaces to work. And sometimes, and for some reason, Evernote just feels so clean and clear and uncluttered and just like it makes sense when I'm in certain mind frames or if I'm just scattered on any given day. 
So that's also a great thing. But the good thing is that Trello really is the center of everything because you're able to pull in Google Docs, Google Drive links, and I can pull in shared links from the Evernote. I can tell people, hey, go over to Facebook, do this. You know, there's there's definitely a back and forth. So I would say right now Trello and Facebook are the best, are the ways that we're communicating and collaborating the most. And, you know, it kind of doesn't matter whether, you know, I think Prerna, for social media, I think she does her updates and she sends those to me, but they're in Dropbox and she does them in Excel. So she doesn't use Evernote or Google Docs really like I do. And that's fine as long as everything goes to one similar place. So that's it. I mean, the the lesson I think for us, and as I'm talking it out, I'm kind of realizing it, is to find... Um, a place to manage all the tasks that need to get done, a way that you can look at everything and be like not totally off your rocker. And I don't know why I said that. Um, and then have another place where you can just be chatty. You can give brief little updates, point people back there. And it's, it's like a faster way of getting responses. Um, of course, there are other little things that we throw in there as well. But those are the main ones right now. And I'm really can't tell you how much I love Trello. And if I hadn't been, if I hadn't peeked in on the video Genesis launch, I might have never switched to Trello. So I have to thank those kind gents for doing that video because um, it just made sense. It just makes sense. I don't have to wait for emails. I just see things move to the different bins. Okay, I'm going to stop gushing. I'm not going to gush anymore about Trello. Find a way you're going to communicate. Find a way that you're going to put all the tasks together. And then you've got you're golden. Have a great day and I will see you tomorrow.